Hello everyone, Catechus Gaming here, and if you're watching this video, you may be like me in trying to play Harvestella on the PC through Steam. However, you keep getting an error message and the game crashes. For me, this happens when I try to load the zone for the second C's light. Not sure if this happens elsewhere or how many times. However, now I'm going to go through a few possible fixes to get past this until Square hopefully patches it, but honestly, who knows if they'll actually do anything? or if they can for that matter. First, I'm gonna get the typical tech support nonsense out of the way. <coughs> Hello, IT. Have you tried turning it off and on again? One, is your computer plugged in? They ask you how you are, you just have to say that you're fine when you're not really fine. Bad joke. Two, try restarting the computer. Again, I know it sounds dumb, but sometimes it helps. Three, you can validate the installation through Steam by going to your game's uh, main page in the library, going over to the gear icon, down to properties, local files, and verify the integrity of the game files. It may find something didn't install correctly. Next option, reinstall the game. It sucks, but it might help. Similar to the validate, something just may have gone wrong during the install. Now, if none of that helped, we can get to the next tips. In the game option menus in Steam, there are some launch options in the general tab. That can be found by going to the gear again, down to properties, and it starts you in the general tab. Down here is the launch options and a text bar that we can type in. There are three different items we can type in here to see if they help. First will be dash D3D11, no spaces, no spaces at the end, nothing. Then close this, start the game, and see if that helps. If that did not help, there are two other uh, items we can type in here. Next will be dash DX11. Similar thing, close this window, retry the area, see if it loads. Lastly is dash DX12. Now this is the one that fixed it for my computer. And similarly, close this, play the game, see if that gets you through. Hopefully this helps, as nothing can be more infuriating than buying a game only for it to not work. If there are any other tips that I missed, please drop in the chat and see you in the game. 